Do you think there's a place for Vili in our settlement? He expressed a desire to live and work with us. Will he not be Jarl of this Shire before the day's end? That remains to be seen. Some are more eager to see Trickvi in the high seat. Eivor, Trickvi has no intention to lead. He feels duty-bound to follow his master into death. Absolutely not. My father would never allow such foolishness. How else can I honor my Jarl, old as I am? This is no country for me. The future is yours, Vili. The frames of this pyre will burn for my father. You must live. I forbid you to follow him into death. I will not let you sacrifice yourself. Do you forbid me as a friend, Vili? Or as our new Jarl? As a man who would see you come to your senses. Vili. Shook me. Each man wears one of Hemingas boots, with both men unwilling to seize the other. Does the world need such useless, dithering men? Why not stake a claim yourself? Take this shire for your own. It is not my place. Your place is anywhere you lay your head, any hill you summit, any silver you take for your own. Do not limit yourself to niceties. Nottinghamshire deserves a leader to admire, a man the people can trust. Most love Billy, and he loves them, but he lacks the will to be leader. He could learn, but does he wish to? And trick me, sturdy and wise and loyal to the legacy Hemminger Jarl left behind. Almost to a fault, but he is old, and his thrill for living has fled him. Hardly inspiring. You cannot! I will not allow it! I am not asking for your permission. Only your forgiveness. Gods, Eivor! Put a stop to this fool's death wish! Trygvi has no Jarl to serve, Vili. He's free to set his own course to the ocean's edge, to trade this world for the next. As are you, Vili. Our lives belong to us. Thank you. Thank you, Eivor. Billy, do not misplace your anger on friends who speak what they believe is truth. <sighs> do as you must, Trivi. I... I will miss you, old friend. And I you, my boy. I must prepare myself for the flames. Body and spirit. Father, we shall be to our children what you were to us. And when they are ready, we will meet you again. You have made this old man proud, each of you. And you, us. Nine days, one eye hung from the tree. Nine worlds he saw. Nine runes he found. Nine nights he bled. Father, receive your loyal servant.
Give him a fine farewell. Eivor! You look uneasy. I'm not so drunk I cannot stand, but... Hang on to me a moment. You do your father proud by this celebration, and by taking his seat. He wanted this, Vili. I mourn for myself, Eivor. For us. You know my heart. It beats for the passion of battle heat. Not... Not this. As long as I've known you, Vili, you have possessed a strength you rarely saw in yourself. A wildness, a joy for life. You are your father's son, but you have never let yourself be the fullness of that man. Not until now. A warrior rises with the dawn to follow fresh tracks in the new fallen powder. For that is where adventure lies. I will follow these new tracks, Eivor, wherever they may lead. People of Hemthorpe, of Ulkethorpe, of Snottinghamshire. We honor neither Trigvi nor my father by continuing to mourn. These men dedicated their lives to bettering all of Snottingham. They died in that service. Now, I humbly pledge my life to following in their path. And I ask each of you to rise and be to me what Trigvi was to my father. Together, we shall build the world they wish to build. You have already learned that people prefer shorter speeches to long ones, Vili Jarl. <laughs> it will take time to wear that title with comfort. My father never swore a formal oath with your clan. There was no need, for you are family. Let it be known, the Hemingers and Clan Raven are true sworn friends from this day forward. Do you accept? Aye. Well... Be fair, be just, and call upon us often. Our stick. I'm sure I will. You know my heart. It beats for the passion of battle heat. Not... not this. As did your father's heart when he was our age. But he grew up, and so shall we. Now go on, man. Show them you are a Hemingerson. I felt the same. But in time we all rise to the needs of the people. Who says you won't come to enjoy it? Yes, yes, you're right. And certainly if you can lead, uh, Hemmingson can. Eivor! You look uneasy. Burdened by grief. Drowning in me. And paralyzed by a sword. I stand between that man and Yaldum. You stand side by side, Willy, and one of you must step forward. 
My father placed us side by side because he trusted your vision. So what do you see? Drunk as you are, I see before me a man full of passion, vigor, and a love for his people. I see a Jarl. Your burden will get easier to bear. Take your father's seat and make it your own. I will. Good. Now let them know, Arstic. People of Hemthorpe, of Ulkethorpe, of Snottingham, today I pledge myself, as my father was, I shall be your Jarl. <laughs> Heminger was a hero, not for who he was, but for the people he led. With Trigvi by my side, with all of you, we will have glory. Old friend, I trust Vili suits you as well as Hemminger. <laughs> the boy becomes more like his father with each moon, though he spends little time in his chair. Find him at Kinder Downfall. For the time being, he has swapped his blade for a fishing rope. To my relief. Fine place for a Jarl to hide. Facing wolves and pigs can grow tiresome, but this quiets the mind. Come, fish with me. I miss him, your father. His long stories, most of all. <laughs> you soften with age, wolf kissed. And now you have your own tales to tell. Put your skulls to work. Do you remember how he would sing us to sleep? I'd close my eyes and dream that my mother was alive by the hearthside. I believe he sung to her. He sang to you both. I should return to Hemthorpe soon. And I to my clan. But for now, our paths keep us here, Billy Jarl. Ah, a reaping of flesh from the wave. I can share it with you, so the Jarl of Snottinghamshire does not return home empty-handed and head-hanging. Very kind of you, Wolfkist. My pleasure, Arstake. 